been shut for a period of two years due to the COVID-19 pandemic, uh, but it resumed once again this year, but little did the Yatris know that there'd be tragedy awaiting them. That's exactly what happened yesterday following a cloudburst very close to the Amarnath cave, where as a result of flash floods, as many as 16 people now have been confirmed dead, more than 60 people have been injured. Now, here's a series of visuals that we've captured since uh, the cloudburst happened uh, that, in fact, uh, gives us a perspective of the scale and magnitude of what exactly transpired on the ground. And uh, we're capturing some important developments in relation to what exactly happened yesterday. The death toll has now been confirmed uh, to be 16. That's three more than those who were reported dead yesterday. More than 40 people are reported missing. Several agencies have been uh, uh, deployed into service. Uh, extensive rescue operations that will continue through the morning into the afternoon and uh, the army is using state-of-the-art equipment to ensure that those who've been trapped under the debris are successfully located and eventually evacuated. The Amarnath Yatra has also been suspended till further notice and Prime Minister Modi has expressed his grief over the casualties and has committed all possible help uh, for the assistance of those who've been affected by this tragedy. Several sorties of uh, armed forces helicopters have also been deployed and thanks to the improving uh, weather conditions through the morning, they've been able to undertake rescue efforts. Let's 